Streamer, so you loved my video discussing how to set up your Wave microphone so that you can get the most out of it and sound as professional as possible. But what if you have one of these? This is of course the Blue Yeti. And if you happen to have one of these instead of a Wave microphone, you still need to be able to set it up properly. Let me show you what settings you need to use to make this mic sound as if you're a pro. So the first thing you're gonna to need to do is to download the correct software that you're going to use to set up this microphone. You're going to wanna to download the Logitech G Hub software. But Smash, that's Logitech software. What does that have to do with the Blue Yeti mic? Let me show you. Once you go to the Logitech G Hub page, you'll notice that there's a blue icon on the top left. That's right, Logitech has integrated blue software into the Logitech G Hub software. So once you've downloaded and installed the software and you've plugged in your Yeti microphone, the Logitech G Hub software will automatically detect that you have a Blue Yeti microphone. To configure it, simply click on the microphone. Once here, you'll see an assortment of tools, effects, and it even integrates with NVIDIA Broadcast to help reduce noise and room echo. But let's get down to the settings that I think that you should enable. You should definitely download the NVIDIA Broadcast audio effects. This greatly helps reduce any background noise or room noise. Next, under Blue Voice, you'll see that it has an equalizer. Set the EQ to your liking. This will be different for everyone. Now where the real magic happens is under signal cleanup. And here you can set noise reduction, gate, compressor, de-esser, de -popper, and limiter. Now everyone's settings are gonna be a little bit different, but here's what my settings are. I set my noise reduction to about 20 decibels, gate at negative 37. This is because I have a bit of a noisy room. My compressor is at the negative 29. My de-esser is at negative 40. My de-popper is at negative 25. And limiter is at 10 decibels. Now these are great starting numbers, but you're going to want to adjust them to your liking, your space, and your voice style. But the real cool thing about using Logitech G Hub to control your microphone is that all the effects and all the noise reduction software and all of the EQ and signal cleanup will work in any Windows application. That includes OBS, Discord, Zoom calls, or any other application that uses your microphone. So now I bet you're wondering, Smash, which microphone is best? The Wave or the Yeti microphone? Well, you tell me. I've switched back and forth between both at least a dozen times. Watch the video again and find out which is which.